What is up you guys? So today I'm going to be giving you a tutorial on how to remove the background of a photo. So let's get started. So I have my picture right here and I'm going to duplicate this layer by right clicking and pressing duplicate layer. So now that we have my photo I am going to press the quick selection tool and then just shape out the area where I want to appear for the photos. So for this photo I just want me and the ledge that I'm sitting on so we're gonna mo remove that entire background. So just use the tool to just drag all the areas. Now if you clicked on an area that you don't want to remove you can just press the alt tool and hold on to that as you use the tool again to erase it. Looks like I'm good so I'm going to press command C and then Command V so I can copy and paste this as a new layer. As you can see I have my new layer and now I'm going to unclick the eyes so that you could just see the layer on the background and you can see how much you cut off. Now import the background that you want to have. So I'm just going to take this and then once you have the size that you want then you can check. Now as you can see it shows me with a new background. Now what I want to do is feather me and the ledge a little bit because it's looking a little too sharp and unrealistic. Now I'm going to use the quick selection tool again to select me. Now let's keep the eyeballs off the other background. So now we're going to right click, click feather and then radius about 20. Now, as you can see, it's feathered just a little bit, so it looks smoother. So now I'm going to keep the eyeball off the first layer that I copied. Now I'm going to use the Erase tool, and remember to keep your opacity at 100% at and move the brush all the way to 25. So now I'm just going to erase some parts to make it a little smoother. So now I think that's good, so I'm just going to delete the necessary layers right now. As you can see, this is the old background and then the new background. And it looks pretty, pretty s nicely erased. Now I'm just going to import another picture of uh, the Milky Way. So I'll have me staring off at the stars. So as you can see, you can see me and the stars. And, and I can export this photo and then edit it a little bit on Lightroom so that it looks a little bit more smoother and realistic, I guess. So yep, that's it. That's the quickest way to remove the background from your picture. I hope this tutorial was useful and thank you so much for watching and subscribe and I'll see you in my next video.